to the MLS zone where we talk about everything that is the MLS and today's video is on the downfall of Columbus Cruise. But before we get into that, you know we're trying to reach 1,000 500 subscribers by the end of the year so hit that subscribe button like and comment down below for the youtube algorithm now let's get into the video and that is the downfall of columbus cruise now and i know you guys are saying wait 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 hold up a minute where have you been and well you're saying like i haven't seen you in three days no new video I've been on vacation, sipping pina colada on the beach, and also dancing in my underwear in my living room. Too much information, yes, but I've been doing nothing, to cut it short. Yes, nada. I've just been watching football. And you're saying, well, you're back. Yes, I am. And you say you're watching me. Yes, I know. I'm going to start putting out more videos to you guys. Now, this is the video we're on, and that is the Columbus right cruise and this is the team that everybody laughs at reason why let's go back into the past and we go in through time because we have to go back to the past to understand why is this team class now the a1 the mls cup in 2008 also you're saying hey that's pretty good they're mls champions well yes and they won the u.s opening cup in 2002 and you're saying really yes it's no joke it's actually true it is true and most fans are saying yes but if you're saying they have also won the supporters shield in 2004 2008 and also 2009 and you're saying if you're a cruise fan awesome yes and you're doing that but i have some things to tell you about this video what the hell happened to that team because it's not performing that well this season after doing research months of diving typing work getting mad because i couldn't find the answers and my friends were concerned i had to just take a break yes one of those break but i finally found the answer yes finally it's about damn time i know and that answer is five reasons five now the first reason we'll be talking about is Columbus crew goalkeeper problem. Now you're saying, isn't Zach Steffen their goalkeeper? One of the best goalkeeper in the MLS? I mean, with saves like these, I mean, this guy's out here like De Gea from Man United and also making spectacular saves like these, you're saying, what the hell happened? Well, Manchester City happened. Yes. Manchester City bought him for 10 mil and he's now at Manchester City and got replaced by this guy, the second goalkeeper. Now, he hasn't been playing so well. Seeing that, he played three matches since Zach Steffen left. Goal conceded per those three matches are 1.3. Saves per game is 1.3, which is 50%. And you're saying, what the hell? I'm saying that too. You know, I'm saying what the hell. And you're like... Come on, is that supposed to be your goalkeeper? Well, yes, but I also have news. There's a done deal of a new goalkeeper that you guys just bought. And if you're saying, where did I get that news? I got that news from the MLS Zone Instagram. He posts the best news, transfer rumors, done deal, everything in the MLS. Go and follow him. You won't regret it. Now, the second reason. Since we already finished the first, it's the second reason. And I have to give it to their injured prone players. I mean, it's really bad for Columbus crew with their players being injured every week in and out. It's so bad like when one player recovers, another one get injured. It's ridiculous. They're like glass bottles just keep on breaking. Come on guys, like really. First, we have this man right here, Militant. He's been injured, Harrison, been out a couple of games and also we have Wylan been out as well we have Hector been out as well and also we have Josh been out as well but all of that my girlfriend still would like you to hit that like button so we can reach 40 likes yes you heard me right 40 likes it's so ridiculous how frequently these players get injured it's basically like this this sexy girl trying to squeeze herself into her pants it's sexy trying to see these players get back but when they do it's not that sexy because they get injured again well the third reason 
Yeah, the third reason. I got to give it to the lack of offense in the team. Now, I asked a lot of Columbus Crew fans, how is this that they have a lack of offense when they have players such as Zardes? But then I looked at the stats and I'm like, they're making sense. With only playing 15 matches, scoring six goals and one assist, it's like, what the hell, man? But you're saying, what about, what about Pedro? Now, Pedro played 18 match, scored four goals, and had two assists. But then again, you're saying, what about, wait, 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 what about, what about Higuain? Yes, he played 14 match, one goal, three assists. Now, if those are your main offensive force, it's like, fuck, you know what I mean? Like, come on. To be honest, if I was a Cruz fan, I would be banging my head against the wall. And I'm not talking about the song. Now, the fifth reason, wait, I can't count. Fourth reason, got to say is the manager. And you're asking, who is the manager? Now, gotta give it to Porter. Now, he is the manager. Now, you're saying, what's his record? He has coached 20 matches, won six, Drew 2, lost 12. Yes, lost 12. You heard me right. You're saying, what kind of shit is this? Yes, I already see it on your face. You're like, give him time. He's just give him time. Just 20 matches and other fans like, the fuck? What are you talking about? They want to kick that man out the club so bad. You know, it's really bad. But the fifth reason so we could wrap this nice video up. The fifth reason is I gotta give it to the fans. The fans are the fifth reason. And let me tell you why. The fans turn their back against the team when they go down in the first leg. I see it myself. They give them the middle finger when they're not performing well. And I get that. As a supporter that spend money, you don't want to do that shame walk out of the stadium. And so does the players because when the players lose, they go away hiding and which leads the fan to give them the fingers. So that's why I have to give them the reason. And that's why I have to give the fifth reason to the fans. But what I want you to do is vote right now. Tell me, is it the manager, the injured players, the fans, the lack of playing style? Just vote, you have the opportunity. And I know you're saying amazing content, like always. But what I want you to do so you can help us out is comment down below, like, and subscribe for the YouTube algorithm. And you're saying, oh my God, I can't believe the video come to an end. And I'm saying yes, but I want to show love. So have a beautiful day. I love y'all. Enjoy the music.